Hello, everybody. Today we're going to introduce you a new set of uh, brushes that we just uh, got on our website. The uh, fountain brush. We have three kind of uh, brush heads made of different uh, uh, bristles. Now let's take a uh, look of the, the structure of the fountain brush. In the middle of the handle, you'll see the reservoir where you can, you can store ink or color. And I just use clean water to go with uh, watercolor blocks when I draw outside. I don't have to carry water with me. If I, if I use indoor, you can just use it like a regular brush without um, load water in it. When the brush is new, the head is glued. It's kind of hard, so you need to soak the new brush to wash out the glue. First, you dig into clean water for about 10 minutes in room, room temperature water. Um, you can use uh, a finger to squeeze the water, the brush head squeeze, uh, to squeeze out the glue out and clean the remaining glue. Rinse in the rainy water, if you will. Uh, you need to clean out the glue completely, not just halfway before using. Let's take a closer look of the structure of uh, the fountain pump. In the middle of the handle is uh, the reservoir. It's hollow. You can see a transparent section. And uh, the upper part of the handle is the pump. Uh, brush end is turnable. In the new brush, it's up, so you need to, before you start loading water, you need to turn the end of the brush. You can see the pump is slightly, is moving downward, drive out the air. You, you need to turn the end of the brush all the way, so the pump all, all the way down to drive out all the air in the reservoir. Now we are ready to load water. Now we dip the brush into brush head into the water and uh, turn the end of the uh, handle, brush handle, so you can see the pump start to draw up. Water comes. So you start to load the water into the reservoir. This uh, aqua brush is very useful with uh, watercolor blocks or dry watercolor or sumi color blocks. You can just touch the color with uh, the water brush, aqua brush. So you load the color now. Just like a regular traditional brush, a watercolor brush, you can draw lines or um, wash. Depends on how you hold uh, the brush and your stroke. When it gets drier, you can move slower. Uh, when the moisture is exhausted, you can Add more water by turning the brush end a little bit, a few. Yeah, that's probably it. very convenient when you paint outside.
You can also use the brush for drawing cartoons or graphic uh, design. This is the soft brush. The stiff, br the stiff brush can use to draw the lines and the water watermelon. This is nice. The aqua brush is, can also go with the water soluble crayon. See how nice that is? So the color has a nice water color look um, with the fountain brush water added to the water throwable crayon. And you can use the rest of color to draw even, right? So use like a palette. Um, it's very useful when you draw outside uh, anywhere when you travel. You don't have to carry ink or water. It's a, a good um, watercolor, dry watercolor matte brush with water supply. Now the whole set contains of uh, three different uh, brush heads. The nylon brush, the brush head is made of synthetic fibers. The advantage of synthetic hair is the brush head is always pointed. The second one is uh, a combination brush. Um, you can see there's a stiff hair core in the center um, mimic the natural wolf hair and the, the surrounding uh, the outside is the white goat hair both of the hair are artificial synthetic ones but uh, very high quality um, just like uh, the natural hair would do very versatile brush you can draw both the wash and the lines uh, very useful brush. The last one, the third one is a stiff hair brush, just like a, a wolf hair brush um, for liner and uh, um, draw sketch lines, outside, you know, outlines, that kind of thing. So together the whole set will do everything for you when you uh, paint both inside the studio or outdoors. Um, it has uh, the reservoir and the water pump. It's just the amount of water whenever you need. Uh, you can use it as a regular brush at home or carry it uh, your favorite brush anywhere you go on the way. Um, hope you like it. Thank you for watching.